What's up everyone? Uh, I have a really short video tonight. Um, I just want to share something kind of fun with you guys. Uh, a fella came up, brought uh, his gun with him to get a holster made. And uh, it's not necessarily a gun that I need, as you can tell, you know, it's just a regular SIG 1911. Um, however, I don't have any footage or photographs necessarily of it featuring this product. And I, uh, I was so excited, I just, uh, I couldn't share it. I couldn't wait to share it. And it's the Desert Scorpion. A totally badass gun, which I have coveted, to be sure. And I just wanted to share it in its natural habitat with you guys. And check this out. I think it turned out really well. I think the uh, the colors match really nicely. I think the uh, the green goes really well with the uh, with the color scheme of the gun. You know, of course, it fits really well. It's good definition. Uh, man, I'm sorry. It's been a it's been a little bit of a long day. I worked all day on this. Peter came up in the evening. I've basically been working for about uh, 13 hours on nothing but holsters. Uh, some fun stuff went up on the um, on the Filster uh, Facebook page. I did a bunch of M&P holsters for uh, Reggie, and those turned out really well. I didn't make a video on them though. However, um, if you're if you're not already checking it out, uh, check it out because a lot of uh, new products and uh, new things are. You know, newly minted holsters are going up on that venue when I don't really have the time to make a video on them. However, I really wanted to take the time and uh, share this, uh, share this one with you because I think it turned out looking really good. Um, at the uh, recommendation of uh, some subscribers, I bought a cheap uh, buffing wheel, and that goes a long way towards the overall edge quality and I'm actually going so far as to buff the belt loops as well and they're coming out and looking very professional. This does a really good job. The buffing wheel does a really good job of keeping the edges uh, excuse me uniformly uh, textured and then for tighter spots I can get in there with the uh, the Dremel and take care of these little crevices but the buffing wheel makes quick work of the, uh, the finished work. And you can get one like uh, like this guy here for, I put the sticker on here to cover up the fact that it says, Made in China. Um, and besides, I uh, clipped this out of the uh, Safe Arms Review bumper sticker. Uh, it's just like the, having the gun there. But uh, at any rate, uh, yeah, this guy was like 30 something dollars on Amazon and it uh, makes a world of difference. But anyway, back to the main event here, the SIG 1911 Scorpion. Kicking ass. This, uh, I'm very pleased with this. I'm very pleased with this one indeed. So, uh, man. I want to get one of these in the uh, commander length with the threaded barrel. That's what I want. That's going to be amazingness at its, at its peak. Uh, for me, I'm kind of I'm kind of hooked on these. But at any rate, thanks for watching. Uh, check out the uh, Filster Facebook page for more um, for more recently made holsters and uh, good luck on your own projects.